Google's quantum revolution, the Willow chip that outran the world's supercomputers. So Google just dropped a quantum bombshell. Their new Willow chip ran a computation 13,000 times faster than the world's best classical supercomputers. Published in Nature, repeatable, verifiable. That's what scientists call quantum advantage. Here's why that matters. Classical computers run on bits, zeros, ones. Quantum computers run on qubits, zero, one, both at once, superposition. And when qubits are entangled, changing one instantly links to the others. That combo lets a quantum processor explore a massive space of possibilities at the same time. Google's breakthrough uses an algorithm they call quantum echoes. It's built for simulating molecules. One of the hardest problems in computing. Why do we care? Because molecule math drives real stuff. New drugs, better batteries, clean energy, wild new materials. Classical machines tap out fast. A few dozen atoms, game over. Willow ran the simulation and smoked classical rivals by a factor of 13,000. And crucially, this wasn't a one-off party trick. The result can be checked. It's repeatable. So is this the moment quantum takes over everything? Not yet. Think of two phases, quantum advantage, quantum usefulness. This is advantage, a narrow task, decisively faster than any classical computer. Usefulness is when it powers broad, real-world applications. We're not there yet. The blockers are brutally real. Qubits are fragile. Heat, vibration, a whisper of noise, and poof, coherence is gone. That's why these chips live in cryogenic fridges, colder than outer space. Scaling from dozens to millions of error-corrected qubits is the Mount Everest. Google's next milestone, a long-lived logical qubit. Stable, built from many physical qubits, able to run long computations without falling apart. And there's a ticking clock on cybersecurity. At scale, quantum machines could crack today's encryption, RSA, ECC, using algorithms like Shor's. We're not at that danger level with Willow, but the message is clear. Post-quantum cryptography has to land before quantum matures. Inside Google's Quantum AI Lab in Santa Barbara, this is the sequel to Sycamore's 2019 claim. Sycamore was controversial. Hard to verify, not very practical. Willow plus Quantum Echoes is different. Rigorous, testable, aimed at meaningful physics. And the race is global. IBM's pushing 1,000 plus qubit superconducting chips. Microsoft's chasing topological qubits. Intel's betting on silicon qubits.